Welcome back to the last part of our chicken coop door build. Give me that boy. So in this part, we're just going to be plugging this up and testing it to see if it's going to work as we want it to. So I've just got my power supplies that I told you about. Uh, first, I'm going to plug up the motor controller and you'll notice that a red light comes on. And then I'm going to plug up the Arduino. See if it works. There's our code that says pull the door up to the top as soon as this thing starts. Okay. Now we'll see if the sensor thinks it's dark. Yep. Thinks it's dark in here. Looks like one second is not quite enough to get the uh, locking totally in place. Let's shine some light on here and uh, make it think that it's daytime. That's that four seconds wait. Looks like everything's in order. Let's see how the locks work here. Looks pretty good. Uh oh. So, okay. Looks like one second is not enough to get those locks in, and therefore. Um, I was able to pop it loose. So let's go in the code and make it two seconds instead of one second. And that'll let these locks um, fall into place. We'll give this a try again. Uh, your code will have that change in it. So it'll uh, go down for an extra two seconds before it uh, stops. So let's see what we get here. All right, see what we get here. Nice. Looks like that locked in place a lot better. Uh, they can't see. Nice. Okay. I think that did the trick. Thank you for watching this series. It's been fun. Uh, I learned a lot. I had never used uh, the Arduino before, or a motor controller, or reed switches. So uh, it was fun. And uh, the next step, of course, which I'll film for you to see, is to uh, actually install this into the chicken coop, which I've not built yet. Um, so the main thing about installing this will be, of course, having a power supply out at the chicken coop and then uh, wiring up that photoresistor to, uh, to be outside of the coop. Well, um, if you've enjoyed this series, thumbs up on all the videos uh, and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, I've got tons of ideas rolling around in my head just waiting to get out. Thanks for watching. I'm Seth Johnson with Land the House and I will see you next time. Bye. Wally.